Lot number 109 is a 2002 Bluebird bus. This is a 26 passenger bus. It's like a mini bus. It's not as big as the regular buses. It's almost like half the size. As you can see, it has a Cummings engine, which sounds great. The motor runs good. It's got only 24,000 original miles. The only reason why the city is parting with it, number one, it's a 2002. Number two, the floor deck underneath the rubber cover is made out of particle board, like a wooden board that's rotted. Not the chassis, not the body, not the frame. That's a wooden plank, which is made out of a composite, uh, compressed wood. I'll show it to you up close. But other than that, this bus has barely any use for a 2002 with 24,000 original miles. The body is straight. It's got the nice aluminum wheels. No dents, no scratches. The paint is even good. The decals will be removed professionally. Try to avoid damaging the paint. We're gonna do, the city's gonna do their best. It's got the nice wheels, all the windows open and closed properly. The AC is blowing cool. I'm not gonna say cold. I couldn't turn on the back ones on. I didn't figure it out. But it has back dual AC, front and back. But the front one's blowing cool. It's not regular air, it's pretty, feels cool. A little cooler than normal air, but not cold. All right, the rims and tires are nice. I believe those are Alcoa wheels. Really nice aluminum wheels. The tires look good, have lots of thread. Look at that, look how much thread. Amazing. Very good tires, good years, G159. All right, look at this body. Nice and straight. The bumper looks good. The back window, the lights. It's got a handicap lift, wheelchair lift. That's the right name. Let me open this door, see if I can open it. Yep, here it is. It says Braun. Millennium Series. Unfold. Out. Uh oh. It works. There it goes. I've never had one of these work, honestly. Okay. It folded out. Wow, look at that. And I'm going to bring it down. I hope it goes back up. Okay, here we go. Down. This. This bus was fully operational up to the last minute. Look at that, down to the ground. Ready, it's got the suspension. The suspension lifts and lowers. Look at these hydraulics, look how nice. I'm gonna show you the inside now. Well, the lift works great. All right, here's the problem, look. This piece goes there, and it broke off, and it became a hazard for transporting people. So the deck is particle board, that's all wood. And that wood is rotted, and it feels a little soft in the back, but the rest of the floor feels okay. But uh, let me show you the engine, the Cummings. Motor sounds great. I'm gonna rev it up for you. Let me get over here. Wait. Oh, oh, wait a second. I'm trying to accelerate, it's not doing anything. Let me see. All right, it says the park is on. Got 24,756 20, 24, miles. And this one says 25,000, no, 2,586. That must be the trip counter. It is the odometer. And now let me see how many hours. 5,593 hours. All right, it's not 
not accelerating. I wanted to accelerate it. Maybe it does that on purpose. It's been idling for a long time. So I'm going to turn it off. I'm going to turn it off and turn it on again so you can hear the battery is good. All right, and the motor starts right up. Motor sounds great. All right, let me show you. Let me turn it off because I'm screaming my life away here. And uh, the steering wheel looks good. The dash looks good. It's cracked over here. See the ba the panel right there is cracked. The side panel looks good. I don't know if that Motorola radio is coming out or not, but whatever the city owns, they're going to take off whatever they need. Uh, like I said, you see the floor is rotted. The, the wood underneath. Uh, the vents, the AC vents look good. Like I said, the AC is blowing cold. The seat, the seat shows somewhere. As you can see there. You see that? The front seats. A little bit of uh, unstitching going on there. That one looks good. That one has a little bit of separation there. Right there. They're not too bad. They didn't get rid of it because of that. They're getting rid of it because of the floor. All right. The back seats look good. People usually ride in the front because the bus is never full. Okay. And the back. And here we go with the lift. The lift works. All right. This vent is sticking out. Let me see if I can put it back in. There. Okay. Well, as you can see, it's got two dual AC units. On I see the two in two vents in the sides, and it's got the AC in the front. It's got the cable to pull to stop whatever you want to get it off. But the floor over here in the back feels a little soft. It feels soft back here, right here. I feel like a like an indention all right so but uh it's in pretty good condition very low miles the motor sounds great and uh i couldn't get it to rev up i don't know why it might be a mode that it's in when i when you start it up and let it run for a while i don't know but the motor sounds really good i was told that the uh it runs and drives but you know what? I can't vouch for that because I didn't drive it. But the motor sounds good. 5.9 Cummings. All right, that's pretty much it. Nothing else I can say about this bus. It's got a lot of potential. Good luck.